Hi, I'm Nita Gill with VegetableFruitCarving.com. I'm going to show you how to make a pretty fringed cucumber garnish. It works well as a plate garnish or as a drink garnish as shown on this cucumber basil gimlet. But first, there are two things I'd like you to be aware of. One is that you can find all kinds of great ideas and photos for food decorating and garnishing on my blog at www.VegetableFruitCarving.com slash blog. And two, if you'd like to be notified when I add more videos like this to my YouTube channel, go ahead and subscribe to my channel now. To make this garnish, you'll need a cucumber, a peeler, and a paring knife. It's really quite simple. Take your cucumber and you'll make several slices, several strips with your peeler like this. And let's make one more. Okay. Once you have your strips all ready, you want to take your paring knife and we're going to start by cutting beginning right at this midline. We're going to be making diagonal cuts about an eighth of an inch apart all the way across the cucumber, all the way across the length of the cucumber. Once you've got that done, you can cut this last little end off. You simply roll up your cucumber like this. And there you have a pretty fringed cucumber garnish. Now there's a couple of things you can do with it. You can put a toothpick to hold it in place and add that to a plate as a decoration. Or, if you like, you can make a drink garnish by taking it and you'll hold it here and you want to make a diagonal cut through all of the layers like that. Okay, then when you get your glass, you simply place it on the rim of the glass, just like that. Simple. It makes a really pretty garnish for a cucumber, basil, gimlet, or martini. You can get this cucumber basil cocktail recipe on my blog by clicking on the link in the description below. It will take you to my blog at www.vegetablefruitcarving.com slash blog. Thanks for watching. I'm Nita Gill. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs>